what are the steps yeah uh, so uh, you're right it is a learning uh, a learning phase and it, it's evolving very fast but it does actually funnily enough tie back into that philosophy it ties back into the the philosophy of identity and who we are for ourselves and what it means to be us we also have this perception of ourselves we have we have an idea of who we are for people which you know isn't always the, the version of ourselves we put out there right so we are we are you know we have an idea of who we are in ourselves we have an idea of who we would like to be and then we have this this put this avatar that we put out to the, the the world either through twitter or social media or you know and then that avatar changes depending on who it's interacting with we we tend to be a certain way when interacting with clients, customers, you know, in a professional setting, different versions of our own identity. And the, 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 the subjectivity of identity is one of the hardest parts to get this to, to really like think about how to capture this. And so there is always going to be a balance of that. And I think some people will want to edit themselves. Some people will want to present themselves in a different way as they have throughout history. Uh, no one obviously sees themselves as the bad guy at any point. <laughs> Uh, even though there must there must be, um, so it's 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 a fascinating concept to think like you know what where where does the true identity sit in the mix of all that.